Well, we are headed out to the bean field uh, this afternoon to see if we can't see some hogs or some velvet bucks. We got to put a few cameras out to see if we can't get some, start getting some pictures. Um, so our 2020 season begins today. So we're going to be bringing you some YouTube videos, putting out some content to let you know how we are getting ready uh, for this year. We're going to be shooting our bows a lot. I'm going to hunt a lot with the recurve this year. I am itching to get a deer with a recurve, so I will be hunting a lot with a recurve, so you can follow that story. Um, but it's gonna be awesome, so let the season begin. Let's go. All right, here's the deal. We just pulled through this uh, cornfield right up here about 35 yards is a bean field so there may be some hogs out in this bean field we don't know so I'm gonna grab the AR load it up real quick we're gonna sneak up to the edge of this bean field and see if there's anything out there so hang tight locked and loaded baby sneak up here and see what's up This is raw, real raw. <laughs> oh, there's a deer. There's a deer right there. It's over there on that field. see a hog, but there was a deer for sure right there on it. That's nice, that's good. Let's go get in the truck and drive around, put some cameras out, and then we'll sit around on the turn and wait on some hogs to come out this evening. All right, we done, uh, we done stopped the truck right now, and uh, we're gonna put some batteries in our cameras, and, uh, and then we're gonna put these cameras out on the edge of this field and see if we can't get some deer coming out out of the woods into these beans. Uh, we're just gonna walk the turn row and see if we can't find some good trails and put the cameras on those trails. So anyway, let's do it. I want to show you guys something. Um, I was walking down this turn row and I got to a particular spot that I saw a lot of tracks. And so I looked down to see what kind of tracks there were. And if you're not real careful, if you don't know what you're looking for, you'll fool around and think it's deer tracks, but it's really hog tracks. So I want to show you a picture of this hog track and show you the difference between a deer track and a hog track. So let's get down here. Let's see. All right, you can see this track. Well, one of the main differences with the deer track and a hog track is the hog track is it, split toe just like the, you know, it's split up just like a deer, but it's round. It's more round on the side. And so when you look at the track, it's kind of rounded instead of, you know, more long, elongated. So that's just one thing that you can look at to make sure that you're not getting mixed up between a deer and a uh, and a hog. So, hey man, that's your that's your that's your hunt reel tip of the day. I'm no hog specialist, but I do know that much. All right. Well, it's starting to rain, so we're gonna have to. We got to get out of here. We'll get stuck. So we're gonna try to hunt a little bit more uh, this week. So maybe we can get you some footage before this is all over with. So hang tight with us.
That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, son. Yes, sir. That's what we want to see. That's not on us, but that's just on, in the field right next to us. So, shoot you, yeah, son. Velvet bucks, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Just gets me fired up, son. I saw him. I saw them horns sticking out of these beans when I passed by, and I just slammed on the brakes behind this tree and out there with my camera. So, loving it.